Hi sisters, I'm Alphaside and I'd like to thank you all for 1,500 subscribers. From the bottom of my heart, I deeply appreciate it and I... Uh, Sammy, wrong video, dude. Oh, whoopsie. Don't care, don't care, don't care, still don't care. I don't care, I don't. I don't care. Striper Fox asks, when will you play Roblox? <coughs> Zai asks, where did Wolfaside come from? Right, so very, very funny story, okay? So let me take you back to uh, November 16th, 2017. Okay, so me and this dumb rat named Nexiru, right? We were in a call and I was like, hey dude, I need a name for my new channel. Uh, I want to have Wolf in it because I'm a fucking retard. What should we name it? He goes, well, you want the suffix, yes? And I'm like, yeah. And well, so I wanted a suffix. I couldn't think of one because I was dumb baby cowboy. And he goes, how about the, how about the side? Like wolfy side, like, like genocide, undertale, funny, funny. And I was like, that is a great idea, wolf aside, let's go with it. And that's how I ended up with this horrible, tremendous name that no one likes. Gabe Cruz asks, would you rather be a micro or macro? If you were a macro, would you be a nice one or an evil one? And what would you do? If you were a micro, what would you do? Can you please read more Wattpad stuff? Uh, uh. Now, number one, I applaud you for being so open about your kinks and fetishes. That is something that not many people are able to do. Um, no, I will not check out your Wattpad. But, um, you know, I'm not gonna answer this question. I'm gonna answer these three at the same time because they're a bit similar. Does your parental guardian support you in what you're doing with your YouTube career? If not, why? Do you plan to turn YouTube into a career? So, where do you see your channel going? I know this is somewhat uh, what of a hopeful and morbid question, but uh, what would you ideally hope your future channel would be? And the more part is, what would you think would kill your YouTube, be your passion or your channel? I wouldn't call it a career. YouTube isn't something I want to do as a permanent career choice in my life, as it's too unstable and I don't make anywhere near enough. The only money I make is through Patreon, which isn't even remotely close enough to afford my own house or monthly rent in an apartment. After all, I'm still in high school. <laughs> but my parents do think it's cool, I guess. They applaud me for it, but uh, doesn't bring enough in my bank account for them to be super happy. And what will kill my channel? It'll be my passion, not my stats. My motivation and moral passion for YouTube is more bipolar than Kanye's tweets. Do you play on Xbox, PlayStation, PC, and do you think you'd make a video of playing game with subscribers? Maybe in one of my voice chats on my Discord server? <coughs> Join. I'll record us playing something one day for having a really fun time or something, but besides that, probably not. I play on PC and Xbox, and mainly PC. I almost never use my Xbox for some reason. Miskeeping us. Hi sister, so what made you originally want to start commentary videos, and what do you want to do with the future channel? Love the gaming video, do you plan to do more? Thanks sister, bye hun. Spock to Tech and Pangasidus, I binge watched both back in 2017, those, made, those two made me want to make the same type of content. The future of my channel, I'm just gonna keep doing whatever I feel like. I plan on doing more uh, gaming videos. Yeah, it just depends on my mood. No problem sister. You asked an essay. I'm gonna skip the number six. Pizza. Taco. I guess people still don't know my sexuality. Yes, don't know, Junkie is part of them, gladly. What are your favorite bands slash artists and games? My favorite bands and or artists, they, they fluctuate often, are this right now. Travis Scott, Childish Gambino, Rich Brian, Billie Eilish, Lil Wayne, and AJR. My favorite games, I actually don't have any, but I do have the games I'm playing a lot right now, which are Dark Souls 3, CSGO, and GTA. Also Minecraft, I'm playing Minecraft a lot lately. I don't know, Drama would probably be the best bet for me. No. The entertainment I get from bitching about something I don't like and people applauding me for it, by that I mean my friends. No. And, uh, definitely not. What's your favorite mob from Minecraft? I don't have one, but, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> if you were to change one thing about you started this channel, what would it be? Well, um... What isn't there to change? Sure, my videos had a pretty great childlike passion I can't quite recreate now, but in some ways they were just so lazy. On top of that, a quantity of my first 15 videos were direct copies of other YouTubers. Being short, copy a cat soon. Coming out as a furry, Frankie X. Birthday, Zalgaloo. Pet peeves, eh, Domix? Other kin, Cothrix, OC Rose, Spoctotech. From there, I did everything with my own ideas. I assume a big part of it is also having an upload schedule. I did one video per week from December 2017 to May 2018. That wasn't the best idea. If I tried to do weekly videos now, I'd most likely die, but haha, <laughs> funny dog. <laughs> Take that shit, dog. I'm about to be jello, man. This sounds like a sexual question, but I know damn well it isn't. Next. Well, I, I can't just say jacking off. 
So I guess hanging out with the people I'm the closest with, or kicking back and listening to music, like Frank Ocean or fucking Slayer. <coughs> so I spent about an hour thinking about this, and to be honest, no facade, I don't think I have one in my home life or IRL in general. Not even trying to be edgy, but growing as a person mainly came from online. Sure, I gained experiences and learned things in real life, but the closest thing I've had to heroes are online. And with that, I wouldn't even call them heroes. To my doctor, and I have three close friends that have helped me grow the most in recent years. Also, helped me through countless endeavors. I wish they were my personal life, of course, but unfortunately not. That's how the world works. That's the closest resemblance to an answer I have for you. Pineapple pizza. Eat or yeet? Yeet. Easily. Fuck off. What is your creative process when making content? My creative process is probably the messiest thing on earth. Well, like most quirky kids. I get my video ideas from conversations I have with friends or if a certain event occurs that gives me such idea. It's mostly option number one though. Then after I get an idea, I take four to five days to write the script because I'm lazy as shit. Then I procrastinate further and take three to four days to edit until I finally sit down and finish it in one night. I spend more time thinking about making the video than actually making it. <laughs> I've been doing YouTube since 2012 spread across four different channels. This is my fourth and most likely final. First one was vlogs and machinimas, the second and third were Roblox content. I don't like I don't like reflecting on that. And I don't remember having any ideas for names besides Wolf Aside, if I'm gonna be real with you. And with that, Smash. I'm sorry if I didn't answer your comment, there were over 50 questions, and I didn't want to answer all 50 of them. I tried to answer as many as possible with it not becoming too stale. Anyways, thanks for 1.5k and hopefully we can hit 2k by tomorrow. Thank you. Sorry. I never see you. 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 I never see you anymore.